The following is a production of Learfield Sports. It was a championship week for the Wisconsin Badgers basketball program as they wrapped up their fourth Big Ten regular season title under Bo Ryan and the 18th championship all time in program history. We'll take a look back at the games against Michigan State and Minnesota and we'll also take another look at the post game trophy presentation after the victory against the Spartans. We'll check in with one of the seniors, Duye Dukin, and of course we'll sit down with head coach Bo Ryan. All that is coming up on today's edition of the Badger Sports Report. It's the defense, he'll throw the Gosser high on the right with Valentine on Josh. Inside feed, Hayes will catch, Clark defending, single coverage, spin move baseline, up goes Hayes and in. The quick twist, getting by Marvin Clark. Koenig, left of the circle, throwing to Kaminsky left side, four to shoot, here's Frank, left of the lane, the pull up, jumper, cut off the glass! Kaminsky with 31, 66-53 Wisconsin. And for the 18th time in program history, and for the fourth time under Paul Ryan, the Wisconsin Badgers are champions of the Big Ten Conference. He'll scoop it to Duke and for three, straight on, in and out, no good. Rebound, Decker. Oh, he just took it away from Morse. And now Decker, baseline left, driving to the rim, slam dunk, counted, and a foul. Oh, that was nasty. And one for Sam Decker. Hayes left of the circle. Ball screen from Decker. Hayes now has slipped. Maintains the dribble, recovers, and goes to the rim for the layup. Nigel Hayes with a globetrotter-like move. Baseline right, backing on Kaminsky. Walker knocked away by Frank. Diving Gosser. He tips it to Koenig. Turnover, Minnesota. And Kaminsky and Gosser combine. Here's Kaney to the front court, to the line, right of the lane. Takes it out to the right wing against DeAndre Matthew. A throw to Gosser at the top. Goes inside. Kaminsky bobbles, gathers against Walker in the paint. Backing goes up low on the left and in. It counts and a foul. Frank Kaminsky with an All-American move and an and one. Down the lane, right hand. Slam dunk. Sam Decker. And that's the record. Frank Kaminsky. 43 points. Nigel up he goes, and he throws it down. Sam's off at three, left of the circle. Book it. High screen, Kaminsky trade right, left lane line. To the rim, scoops it up and into the right hand. Go right, and the Wisconsin Badgers have punched their ticket to Texas. They're going to the Final Four. The Badger Sports Report with Bo Ryan is brought to you by Charter Communications. By the Dairy Farm Families of Wisconsin, the Wisconsin Milk Marketing Board. By Zimbrick Buick GMC. By Adidas. And by UW Health, a cornerstone partner of Wisconsin Athletics. Most people don't know at UW Health and the University of Wisconsin are national leaders in the field of kidney transplant. They provide new life for those who will likely die without a transplant. And they assure normal life for those who donate. I would know I donated a kidney and together we saved a life. UW Health, remarkable. When you have the fastest internet speeds, you can find anything almost instantly, which is a powerful thing. Because sometimes it's not so much what you're looking for, but how fast you can find it that makes all the difference. Get the most advanced fiber network. Charter Spectrum, where will it take you? The pride that it takes to run a farm how you maintain your land, how you maintain your farm, how you do all those things. It's obviously a huge component of our state. It's funny, whenever you're out in different areas of the country, everybody will say, it's all cheese, milk, dairy. That's kind of what people associate Wisconsin with. And we take great pride in being the dairy state and being a big producer for the rest of our country and for the products that we produce. 
Introducing the starting lineup at Zimbrick GMC. Whether you use your truck for work or play, GMC's full line of trucks, crossovers, and SUVs will handle it with style. Built with your comfort in mind and all the power you'll need to get the job done right. No matter what the season, you'll always get a great deal at Zimbrick GMC. Zimbrick GMC is a proud partner of Wisconsin Athletics. Visit Zimbrick GMC today. A very good week it was for the Wisconsin Badgers last Sunday in the home finale. Wisconsin defeated Michigan State to wrap up at least a share of the Big Ten Championship. And then on Thursday, as some of the players were saying, and at least one assistant coach, they didn't really want to share. So the Badgers are the outright winners of the conference by virtue of the victory against the Minnesota Golden Gophers up at Williams Arena. Congratulations. Uh, that, that one coach, Thanks, very close on the, on the radio, uh, we were talking to Mike Lucas about that. He says, man, I don't want to share. So sometimes you have to be a little possessive. Coach right? Close was one of those guys in school that always uh, had written on his report card, does not play well with others. He, he didn't <laughs> share his his uh, yo-yo. He didn't share his marbles uh, baseball cards when he was in school. But, no, it, you know, if you're going to be in something, then, you know, try to, try to get the whole thing. So I thought our guys... They had that mission. Uh, Frank's the one that started talking about it right away last year, and uh, he wanted to leave here with a Big Ten championship. And now he and his teammates have one, and uh, so does the school, and uh, you know, and everybody else, all the alumni, and heard from a lot of people uh, about how happy they were, former players and and people that have just. Uh, just live and die on every one of our games. Absolutely, we've had a lot to uh, live well about. Uh, live well about with your with your club. Go back to Sunday in Michigan State. Um, it, was, it almost was storybook fashion with the after the game, your guys going into the Grateful Red. Team rushes fans. It's the new yep. the new headline. Team, team storms the fans. Yeah, That's it. storms the uh, student section. They they were uh, so happy to finish the regular season finished the uh, Big Ten uh, home season uh, undefeated um, and the students welcomed them uh, with open arms and uh, it was a good exchange and then we uh, went about accepting the trophy and the seniors are always the ones that get to be right up front with the trophy so they're, they uh, were well represented and um, just the people that stayed for the, for the video, for the senior video uh, you couldn't have scripted it any better. And then everybody got a piece of the net. Uh, and like Frank said, uh, Coach, are, are we finished? Because I'm tired. <laughs> That's what he said after everything was over. He said, I got, I got to get some rest. It's it hard to keep emotion. When I always talk to this or ask players this question on senior day about their emotions, is it hard for you maybe and your staff as well when you see those senior players come out in the brief ceremony before the game and then you're watching the video after the game because you always talk about let's watch them grow and you really get that opportunity in that in just a few minutes in a video to see how yeah. those guys are and growing. we uh, and we shortened the video there, <laughs> there were a lot of thank yous that uh, you know usually I'll say a thank you mm -hmm. I've had a chance to express to uh, the band and also to the to the spirit squad uh, to the grateful red uh, it, it was only for to save some time and to make sure everybody uh, everything moved in a timely fashion. So um, we, we really appreciated the moment, uh, savored it. We'll always remember it. I know the seniors will. And the, and the younger guys are looking forward to their senior day, but they don't want it to come around <laughs> fast. They, they, just slow down and let's enjoy the, the moments that we're going to have. Yeah, it gets here fast enough. I think all yeah. those guys say that. Uh, let's move on to, to the Thursday game at Minnesota. It, it, that's, as you have said, and, and Coach Close, who has a scout for this, and, and all the guys, this is a very talented group here. I mean, that, you go into their place, their last game, they go into Lansing and win in overtime, so you, everybody saw how good they can be. That was pretty impressive, wasn't it? Uh, I felt that we were going to have to play extremely well to go up there and, and get one for the reasons that you mentioned and also it's a tough tougher place to play maybe than some places because of the setting uh raised floor you know that type of thing not that it should matter <laughs> but we have some fun with it it's with just getting yes. off the court and making the uh, roll so that they don't get hurt so they know what it's like if they try to save a ball 
Sam actually saved the ball, but he didn't slide off the end of the court. He came close <laughs> on, on that one in front of our bench. Um, but to go up to Minnesota with the, uh, the athletes that they have and the quickness uh, and the fact that we only had nine turnovers, uh, there, there are people that have gone up there and had 20, you know, mm -hmm. 16 to 20 turnovers um, be, because of their athleticism and quickness. But I thought our guys did a good job of taking care of the ball, and we got good shots, and we made the shots. You know, when you shoot like we did in that first half, um, it, it sure makes the basket on your next shot look a little bigger. Yeah, 63%. The Badgers shot it in the first half, 50% for the game. Minnesota, the Big Ten leader in steals, but didn't get a whole lot again. Didn't get a whole lot at either of the games against Wisconsin during the regular season portion of the Big Ten schedule. Coach Ryan returns in a few minutes with a great day and great question of the week as we continue with the Badger Sports Report. It's 2050. I'm one of nine billion people on the planet. Like most, I live in the city. Our air and water are clean, and there's plenty of fresh food for everyone. My parents are getting old, but staying healthy. Good thing, because my kids will probably live to be 100. Can you imagine? The University of Wisconsin-Madison, preparing minds to meet the challenges of the future before they become the challenges of today. Keep on, Wisconsin. Keep on. Let's hear it for the 18th time in program history and for the fourth time under Bo Ryan, Big Ten champion Wisconsin Badgers. On behalf of Commissioner Jim Delaney and the Big Ten Conference, congratulations to the 2015 Big Ten regular season champion, Wisconsin Badgers. Let's hear it for the coach of the Big Ten champions and Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame finalist, Bo Ryan. Your guys survived the travel hassles. Talk about what this means, winning the Big Ten Championship once again. Well, first of all, thanks to everybody here. This is so special for one simple reason. The seniors, especially a guy like Frank, <laughs> Frank, Frank could have gone late in the second round last year but he but he decided to stay because he loves college and he wanted to get a Big Ten championship so for Duye and Josh and Trey and Frank thank you very much Frank we all know the great year you guys had last year the great run but this was something that you guys talked about winning this trophy winning a Big Ten championship Describe how that feels now, knowing that you have one. It's an unbelievable feeling. Um, winning it on senior day in front of our fans on our last home game for most of us seniors, is, it's an unbelievable experience. It's something you can't put into words. And I know every single one of these guys on this team contributed to this Big Ten championship, and it's just unreal. And we're so happy, but we know we got a lot left. This team is like a family to me. Um, you know, I've been here for so long with these guys, and I know, aww. <laughs> Um, they are. They're really like brothers to me. You know, they treat me, you know, terrible sometimes, but, you know, that's how family is. Um, so, you know, I'm just so happy that, you know, Josh, Duye, Trey, and I get to go out on the right note. There are two Badgers all time, as many of you know, who have scored 1,000 points, have grabbed 500 rebounds, and have kicked out 250 assists. Michael Finley was one of them. Senior out of Port Washington, number 21, Josh Gosser is the other. Captain America. Are you guys really that mean to Frank sometimes? Sometimes. He deserves it, so that's the way it goes. He's right, though. We're family, we're best friends, uh, all the above. So that's what makes us a good team. Give us, in your words, Josh, what it's been like. You've talked about it before, but with everybody here listening now, what it's been like for you to play here at the Kohl Center in front of 17,000 every game, what that has meant to you. It's been a dream, dream come true. You know, I grew up in Port Washington. We got a lot of people from Port here, I think like 60 plus. So uh, it's been my, dream, been my dream to come here and play 
I, I didn't know what to expect, but it's, it's fulfilled all my expectations and more. So uh, we appreciate all you guys. You guys are a big part of this championship, and we, we want some more. So thank you, guys. Let's hear it once again for your Big Ten champions for 2015, the Wisconsin Badgers. It's funny how seeing a clearer picture can lead you to see the bigger one. Get the most HD channels and the fastest internet on the most advanced fiber network. Charter Spectrum, where will it take you? Some call it a miracle. Others call it science. But for those who've needed a kidney transplant like Kelly Crager, they simply call it a new lease on life. For nearly five decades, UW Health and the University of Wisconsin have been national leaders in the field of kidney transplant, providing a new life for recipients and assuring a normal life for living donors. Miracle? Science? Maybe it's a little bit of both. UW Health. Remarkable. Introducing the starting lineup at Zimbrick GMC. Whether you use your truck for work or play, GMC's full line of trucks, crossovers, and SUVs will handle it with style. Built with your comfort in mind and all the power you'll need to get the job done right. No matter what the season, you'll always get a great deal at Zimbrick GMC. Zimbrick GMC is a proud partner of Wisconsin Athletics. Visit Zimbrick GMC today. Field Sports Directors Cup is the officially sanctioned annual award recognizing all around excellence in men's and women's collegiate competition. NACTA and USA Today co founded this esteemed honor in 1993, still widely recognized as the crowning achievement in college athletics. Just think about ending on a high note, you know, we want to, I mean, for personally, I want to have the best, you know, stretch of, of my career, you know, close it out with some good games uh, and, and really have a positive impact on this team. But, uh, you know, as a team, obviously, finish, finish what we started. You know, we set goals for ourselves this season and uh, we've done a good job of completing them thus far, but we still got more work to do. Coming into this year when you had to sit out those first couple of games, how how frustrating was that for you, and how good has it been, you know, to kind of move past that? It was extremely frustrating, you know, uh, being here for basically four years, not playing my first three, uh, and this is kind of the first year that I've really gotten significant minutes. This is something I've been dreaming about ever since I was a little kid, being able to play on a stage like this uh, and get to get two games taken away. It was pretty, pretty frustrating, pretty upsetting. Um, you know, but at the end of the day, you know, uh, team did a great job of taking care of business those two games and. Uh, they welcomed me back with open arms once I got back, and it's been fun ever since. Your first couple of years with the scout team and, and then moving into your, your bigger role, how have you been become a better player in, the, in your term here? Uh, you know, you, you, you learn different things. Uh, as a scout team member, you know, you, uh, you're not going to play the same person that you want to be. Uh, you're going to be emulating different players on different teams, uh, so you look to expand your game. So once you get to that first, uh, first team, you know, there'll be higher expectations and you'll be ready to go, hopefully. Duye Duke in right wing. Steps back, snaps off a three, got it! Count it! And a foul! Duye Dukin with a four-point play chance as he just drained one from deep and got hacked in the process. It's gratifying just to give our thank yous to the fans, uh, being able to win the Big Ten Championship here at home in front of the crowd that's been with us since day one. Um, you know, just kind of give them a, a, a thank you, I guess. And we first started uh, high-fiving people and then just decided why not, what the heck, just started running through them. Uh, and I think that's honestly one of the most fun things I've done, done uh, since I've been here, you know, running through the crowd, uh, you know, being a Big Ten champ. Can't ask for anything better than that. Being able to go out there with your mom and dad and be announced before the game, what, what was that like for you? It was awesome. You know, those are the two people that have had my back since day one. Uh, you know, being an only child, 
Uh, those, I consider them not only my parents, but my best friends. Uh, you know, uh, being able to walk out in front of the Cole Center in front of that huge applause and it was it was a really touching moment. You know, I tried my best not to look at my mom because she started tearing up right away, uh, and I knew if I looked at her, it'd be done for. Uh, so as soon as she started crying, I looked away because <laughs> I didn't want to start crying. That's got to be a strange occurrence to. I guess we only do it go through it once, but you're out there, all the emotions are peaked, and then you wait a few minutes and then go play a basketball game, right? Yeah, you know, it was weird. Uh, as soon as senior day, kind of the whole festivities before the game got done, uh, I just had this huge adrenaline rush, kind of like, let's go, let's go play this game. Like, I was just super excited, and I think all the guys were, um, you know, we've seen it in the past where we didn't take care of business on senior day, uh, and I think the four of us kind of took it upon ourselves that we don't want, to, want that to happen to us. You know, you think about all the great teams uh, that have come before us, great players, uh, and to think that we're the winningest class, uh, it's kind of mind-boggling, to be honest, uh, and to think that we're going to have more wins to add to that. Being able to share that with the other three guys, uh, I think it's a, it's a great thing. In particular, Josh, you know, he's been with me for five years, so I think we've bonded uh, more, so, more so than the other two, but I've known Frank since I was a little kid. Uh, so we have a pretty close bond as well. But I think the four of us came in, you know, just like everybody else did. They wanted to leave a mark on the program uh, and, and really lift it to a level that it hasn't been lifted. And I think we've done a good job thus far. Granted, the job's not done. We still have a third or, third or fourth of the season left to go. Uh, so we're excited to see what's, what lies ahead. Introducing the starting lineup at Zimbrick GMC. No matter what the season, you'll always get a great deal at Zimbrick GMC. Get the Zimbrick GMC today and score big savings. Zimbrick GMC is a proud partner of Wisconsin Athletics. I'm part of the Zimbrick GMC team, and you should be too. Visit Zimbrick GMC today. the fastest internet speeds, you can find anything almost instantly, which is a powerful thing. Because sometimes it's not so much what you're looking for, but how fast you can find it that makes all the difference. Get the most advanced fiber network, Charter Spectrum. Where will it take you? Most people don't know that UW Health and the University of Wisconsin are national leaders in the field of kidney transplant. They provide new life for those who will likely die without a transplant. And they assure normal life for those who donate. I would know I donated a kidney, and together we saved a life. UW Health, remarkable. Whether you're out there training for a big event or you're just trying to stay in shape, I have a bit of advice. It's important to remember that what happens after the workout is just as important as what happens during the workout. My advice, be sure to refuel with low-fat chocolate milk. It has the perfect mixture of protein, carbs, and electrolytes to help you refuel, rehydrate, and build muscle. In Wisconsin, athletes win with low-fat chocolate milk. And you can too. To learn more, visit winwithchocolatemilk.com. The Badger Sports Report with Bo Ryan is brought to you by Charter Communications. By the Dairy Farm Families of Wisconsin, the Wisconsin Milk Marketing Board. By Zimbrick Buick GMC. By Adidas. And by UW Health, a cornerstone partner of Wisconsin Athletics. Time for this week's Great Dane, Great Question of the Week, and we check in with Will in Waukesha. And Coach uh, Will notices, uh, he believes, that the coaches at the University of Wisconsin seem to be very supportive of one another. It doesn't matter if it's a really good time or a tough time, maybe a tough stretch a team is going through. Uh, Will wants to know, is he seeing this accurately? Well, I would say so. Mike Eves' office is right next to mine. He sneezes, I say tight. he says thank you, and, you know, that's... Uh, <laughs> We, uh, we, we tell stories of one another, uh, exchange a few pleasantries. Um, and of course, with, with Bobby Kelsey on the other side, we always see the women's coaches. And 
we're, we're the only sports really over here now with hockey in the Le Mans. Uh, Mark Johnson's over here also. So uh, basically the four, uh, two basketballs and two hockeys are, are in the Kohl Center. And of course, over in the over in the stadium area, the, we we get to see those coaches uh, at different functions and at different times. But we help each other with different fundraisers, different uh, charity things that they're working with that we help with. And then, of course, how do you how do you explain the connection of with the new head football coach being the son of mm -hmm. uh, a gentleman who hired me at Platteville and gave me my first head coaching job as a basketball coach? So. Um, just goes in circles, but yeah. uh, just to have Paul Christ be the head of uh, be the head coach in football, that's pretty exciting uh, for our family because we've known him uh, since he was very little. Well, and coach to coach too. If it's a, no matter the sport, I would imagine you could relate to each other maybe a little bit better than someone who hasn't been a coach too, right? I mean, oh, very much so, or been raised in that yeah. kind of environment. Uh, yeah, and it's and all the other coaches are just class people. I, I think uh, uh, Barry and the administration and the people that have done the hiring and selection of coaches at Wisconsin, just uh, you know, really uh, good people. And you know, of course, Pat before Pat Richter before Barry, and just uh, it, it's fun to be around class individuals yeah. like that. Yeah, a lot of class individuals around here, and a lot of wins for fans to enjoy along the way. Will, we thank you for your question. The Great Dane with the location up in Wausau, as well as four in the Madison area, east side of town, downtown, Fitchburg, as well as Hilldale. The Badgers have one regular season game remaining. That'll be against Ohio State Sunday afternoon in Columbus at 3.30. And the Badgers have the top seed in the Big Ten tournament, which means they are first up Friday morning, 11 o'clock Central Time in Chicago. We'll talk to you next week. Thanks for watching. Wisconsin Cheese, making good food great. The Learfield Sports Directors Cup is the officially sanctioned annual award recognizing all around excellence in men's and women's collegiate competition. NACTA and USA Today co-founded this esteemed honor in 1993, still widely recognized as the crowning achievement in college athletics. It's 2050. I'm one of nine billion people on the planet. Like most, I live in the city. Our air and water are clean, and there's plenty of fresh food for everyone. My parents are getting old, but staying healthy. Good thing because my kids will probably live to be 100. Can you imagine? The University of Wisconsin-Madison, preparing minds to meet the challenges of the future before they become the challenges of today. Keep on, Wisconsin. Keep on.